Hi, my name's Dane and welcome to Five Bookish Facts. Let's go! Today, we're taking a look at Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone by JK Rowling. As you can see, I'm wearing my Gryffindor hoodie, representing, it's a bit big on me. I also think I'm probably a Ravenclaw, but I like red, so Gryffindor, why not? Also, I have a scar, look at my scar. Uh, I got my girlfriend to do it. It makes me look like David Bowie. ASIO FACTS! So it took JK Rowling 12 rejections before she finally got accepted for publication and uh, her literary agent took about a year trying to push this out to different publishers and it was only actually picked up after a little girl called Alice who was the daughter of uh, the chief executive of Bloomsbury. She'd been given the first chapter, loved it and asked for more. It's Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone everywhere except for America. In America, it's Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. And the reason for that is because the American publisher, Scholastic, they thought that kids wouldn't want to read a book that had kind of philosopher and philosophy in the title. So they pushed JK Rowling to change it. She agreed at the time, but she since said she regrets it and that basically she only agreed to it because, you know, she was a fledgling author and um, she didn't want to, uh, you know, rock the boat. Why is my Fitbit vibrating? I just hit 8,000 steps for today, which is my goal, yay. JK Rowling and Harry Potter have the same birthday, so it's revealed in uh, The Philosopher's Stone that his birthday is the 31st of July. And I actually looked up the years, so uh, JK Rowling was born in 1965 and she's 52 at the time of filming. And uh, Harry Potter was born in 1980, which makes him 37 years old, which is just crazy. He's older than me, he's 10 years older than me. Okay, so fact number four, when it was turned into a movie, obviously the first movie of the series, because it's the first book, so you'd be mad to do it in a different order, uh, a lot of people were upset because Peeves the Poltergeist didn't make an appearance in the movie, and it turns out that they actually auditioned Rick Mail for the part, and they filmed some scenes, and um, <laughs> what happened was actually Rick Mail, he kept getting kicked off the set because he made all the children uh, actors laugh when they were supposed to be acting and obviously performing, and uh, yeah, he... he thought he got the part and then he found out when it got to the cinema that he'd, he'd been cut from it. And fact number five, so uh, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone, it turned 20 on June 26th, 2017. Um, so it was published obviously in, back in 1997. That makes the book 20 years old and the scary thing here is that's roughly twice the age of all of the characters in it. Well anyway, thanks as always for watching 5 Bookish Facts, don't forget to hit subscribe for new videos every Wednesday, leave a comment down below and let me know what book or author or series etc you'd like me to take a look at next, and I will uh, see you soon, bye!